Greetings and salutations, my fellow Entropians. I'm right outside of a place called Swirl Shop. All right, yeah, that's right. It's going to be one of those videos where I'm telling you about a place to go to and check this place out. And there's a big reason for it. This place has weapons. This place has a lot of weapons, all right? So you might want to come here. Let me go ahead and, like, not waste your time. I'm going to show you where it is on the map. All right. As you can see right here, it's, like, right here. So it's going to be, like, over through this way. Okay, look. Longitude 17208, latitude 23101, okay? It's the, the Valiant Firebase, which is also where you come to start some lobby quests and stuff like that. Magic. Now, let's go ahead and uh, go inside this little shop so I can show you exactly what all it has. Now, uh... Of course, it has these things, but yeah, follow me. And then over through here, you got amps, finders, uh, refiners. And the thing is, it, it is a legit shop. Like, you can purchase the items outright, right away. Um, it's not like a house, so you can actually come and buy things whenever you want. And I don't know how often it's stocked, but it looks fully stocked right here, right now. And one of the best little things that it has is a, a great big selection of the R Matrix series weapons and stuff of that caliber. Um, we're looking at R Matrix LR20s, uh, BCs, all the way up. Like, here you go. Just take a look. You got 75s all the way up. So if there's anything that you possibly need, I'd come over to this shop. And the thing is, it, it, it's quite cheap. Uh, all right, so I, I usually use an LR30. And these bad boys are way below what I was buying during migration on Calypso off the auction house, okay? Way below. Now, it's it's still going to cost you a little bit of money, a lot of that, but, I mean, it's still pretty cheap. And if you can't find any on the auction house, you're going to have to head here. It's going to be really cool. Now, as of right now, um, I'm still... Still a little bit waiting. Oh, yeah, it also has these. I'm still waiting on a little bit of money, and then I'm going to make that hunt. But it probably might be... Uh, I'm going to be hunting on the Arcadia Moon. Probably might be around the 1st of September or so. So it's going to be a live stream. It's going to be awesome. But I decided to come here to Arcadia because there's a lot of things going on, such as the Rising event, which... I, I suppose just because the moon is released doesn't mean that there is not anything to do on Arcadia, okay? There is a lot of stuff to do on Arcadia. It seems that following bases are under attack, like the Repulse Firebase and the Courageous Firebase. I guess they're having events there and stuff like that. And it's going to be lasting all the way up until September 15th. Look, if you're a little bit disappointed in what the moon has to offer right now, I got this feeling that it's in a beta stage right now because a part of the rising, which is taking place on Arcadia, um, the Arcadia moon isn't full yet. It's it's not full of what it needs to have because the event that is leading up to it being full is happening on Arcadia right now. So you're going to have stuff going down in the Arcadia underground. You're going to have stuff going on in, on Arcadia. So... Don't discount the moon if, if you went there and you're like, oh, it's not complete yet. And it's probably going to be a little bit more complete after the, the 15th. Don't quote me on this. I'm just, I'm just saying there's things going on on Arcadia. But just think of the moon as a soft opening right now. And then we're going to be moving into some more interesting things in the future. Um... It's true. The moon looks amazing, though. Be very careful whenever you're flying out, because, like, no joke, for real, it the pirates are out. You just fly out of the moon, like, go, and then you zone out of the moon and into space, directly into PvP space, waiting 
out there is a bunch of pirates just ready to shoot you down. So don't take your loot out into space at all. Throw that stuff in the storage bin and then leave. And then you'll probably just spawn at the space station and you have to repair your stuff. But don't give those guys any of your money. It, it's a bad idea. Now, probably, um, if I'm not mistaken, or I might be mistaken, but hopefully the uh, the ARC team de develops a method to where if you go out of the moon, there's a little waiting area that's not PvP the moment you get off the moon. Uh, that that would be nice because I wasn't given a warning that I'm about to enter into PvP space right away. So I'm like, hmm, there's supposed to be a warning. It, it just said, well, you're going into space. It's going to cost you money to land on a planet. It had nothing to do with PvP. I was like, okay, well, I'll figure out if I can get away from the pirates out of a safe zone in space. No, I just immediately got shot down almost before my screen even said, oh, you're in space. It was like, oh, you're in space and you're already at 25% hull. Boom. There you go. Uh, I, I lost my, my 7 PED worth of Alice... O Alice oil stuff that I got from that one drop in the last video. It's okay. I I, I don't know. But be very careful. It, it is what it is. Other than that, you might want to come over to Arcadia and see what Arcadia has to offer. If you're really bent on going to the moon to try it out, go ahead. It's, it's, it's interesting. Uh, but the mobs are kind of spaced out a lot. You got to actually go into the actual zones where they are and then they're a little bit more concentrated if you're wanting to fight mobs but it is a miner's paradise just run around and go bloop, drop those probes and, and get your stuff because that it, it it's high stakes mining be careful other than that guys um i'm still just waiting uh give you a little bit of an update day two looks like we managed to get a double day in the arcadia moon a single day in the arcadia underground hey hey it's happening. So, with all this information, I hope that you guys have a great day, a great night, great morning if you're watching this tomorrow or the next day or whenever. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> and, uh, make a comment down below if any of this information has helped you out. Swirl Shop. Hey, it's, it's actually a pretty legit place to go. And I told you exactly how to get there at the beginning of the video. Until next time. Deuces. Peace. Bye.